Oh, what happened here? I think I know. There we go. Okay. Wow, we're already starting off to a funky start. What happened here? I gotta fix it. Alright, spooky. You're, you're making things a little difficult, buddy. Alright, I gotta figure out why my... Why it's not capturing my window, because that's not the right one. One second. Do I want to use that one? It's not going to be the right one. Well, whole capture should be playing. It's supposed to be. Let me... There it is. Alright, well there's the music fixed, but I'm still having the issue of... Ugh, boys. For some reason... I gotta figure out why Clip Studio is not showing. Because I'm not using my capture card today, I'm using my... It's not picking up the window for uh, Clip Studio, so it doesn't realize that that's the program that I want it to be picking up under my overlays. So I'm gonna see if I can fix it real quick. Yeah, my drawing app. There we go. Alright, let's see if that fixes it. That's a bit better. Closer to what I want it to be. Why is it like that, though? Let me, let me resize that. So that it's at least showing the whole... That's better. Okay. So, yeah, I 
when I popped it up earlier, it was showing the, the desktop in general. And I'm trying to get it to show only, or at least I was, I was trying to get it to show only the uh, drawing program. Because I was planning on doing some art today. I also need to go get the reference images that I plan to work with today. Yeah, it's been an odd week. My, my body is struggling a little bit. I'm real tired, but I still wanted to to hang out and do stream. I'm just uh, struggling. Uh, let me see if I can get my reference images up and then actually try drawing. If I can even remember which folder this app is in on my phone. Hi, how are you, my friend? You asked me how I'm doing. I must ask how you're doing. I mean, I could be better. Um, I had I had some issues related to um, my ribs yesterday, so I had to go see the chiropractor. Which luckily it was an issue that I'm aware of, so they were able to fix it pretty easily. All right, I'm gonna also let me make sure that. My YouTube chat has anybody in it, I can at least see it, because I don't know if that actually resolved itself. But I guess I'll keep an eye on it. Uh, to be honest, I don't know which one I want to draw from more. All of these are really good. I mean, well, it's not necessarily that something was wrong. Uh, one of the disorders that I have causes loose ligaments, which can mean my joints can very easily slip out of place. And mo for the most part, I can kind of correct the issues myself, but this was one that I can't really release on my own. So I had to go to the chiropractor so that they could fix that one for me, because <laughs> I couldn't do it. Anyways, ooh, what is my phone doing here? Oh yeah, everything everything's fine. It mostly just caused like a lot of soreness and whenever I would move my arm in a certain way, it was basically referring the pain from that spot on my ribs up into my shoulder and was kind of causing me a little bit of pain, so. Yeah, I would have rather sat in the chair for a minute and have them fix it than continue to deal with it. Sorry, my yeah, I did I did see it. Um, I actually saw it this morning, I think, but I have not actually set that up because being having that bit of pain, I was kind of going back and forth between naps and pain meds. So when I wasn't napping, I really, like all the energy I really had was. Now I usually check my community tab anytime I make a post, but the the issue today was that I like I've been having trouble sleeping, not just because of the pain, but also just because I am a chronic insomniac. Anyways, I often struggle to sleep, so. I didn't sleep very well last night or the night before. On top of that pain, my body's just having a little bit of trouble. So, yeah, very hard to be energetic and actually stick to doing what I said I was gonna do. All right, this guy is broad-shouldered. So. Oh, no, no, I, I just, like, I felt bad for not responding to it, but I saw it this morning when I was, like, still trying to wake up with my coffee rather than when I was even in a place to feel like I could communicate at all. I'm, I'm, like, the opposite of a morning person, but also, like, I'm not much of an evening person either. I'm pretty much just tired all the time, and today is no exception, but... 
I'm trying to at least stream more often. It was just a very odd timing. I don't know if it was because of, like, the weather change or what. But, yeah, that happens occasionally. Like, at least I knew what the problem was, so I was able to just immediately... I haven't yet. I gotta start by making the account, and then I'm gonna set up the actual server. But my other problem is that I don't... I'm not on Discord very often, even when I had my other account. Well, I guess I technically do still have the other account, but it's... Rarely ever gets used. Alright, so now for the closing on this one. I'm gonna pop this shoulder up a bit, just a tiny bit. Because this guy's like really confident, unlike me. And also like decently muscular. You have an idea? I, I would at the very least love to hear your idea. Alright, this guy also has... This. That doesn't quite look right. But I do want to at least... Sorry if my keys clacking is too loud. usually leaves it down. More like a loose style. Oh, well at the very least, like, there's nothing really to lose in setting up your own Discord server. I've known a lot of creative friends that have set their own, like, set up their own type of thing. I'm just... I'm really not good at managing it, and I don't really, like, honestly, Discord is kind of chaotic for me, so it tends to be a little bit much. So I don't know that I want to manage another server again, to be honest. Like, I've been part of a server several times before, but I tend to get distracted because I'm always doing too many things. All right, we're gonna have his hand in the pocket right there, and then... I don't like what that did. All right, bottom of the rib cage would be right about there. Let's see a bit broader too. I mean, absolutely. Like, at the very least, like, you can definitely set up like a fan server and you can, like, I can be part of that and just, like, <laughs> I'm not gonna be upset about somebody starting a fan server. That, that's like, that's extremely sweet. Why would I be upset about that? Like, why would I not want you to do something like that? That's super freaking cool. Plus, you'd probably be better at managing a Discord server than I would anyways. I get distracted far too easily, and basically all I ever want to be doing is drawing, gaming, or reading anyways. So when I'm not doing some kind of art or playing a game, like, I'm just like, let me sleep. Don't bother me. I am, I am a very cat-like person. I'm like, just, just let me do my thing. How do I do like a cock tip? Uh, 
Oh, wow. Okay. I mean, that works. I just still have to set up the new account and everything. That was one of the things that I was going to do yesterday and then ended up not doing because I was in enough pain that I didn't want to stay conscious. The weird silver lining of getting those problem joints released is that it tends to, like, the ache in the muscles remains for a bit longer even after the joint is released. So, like, that that little spot was just, like, still, still super sore and tender. Alright. Let's sketch in a little bit of detailing in clothing. Trying the fancy outfits for this guy just reminds me of my college days. Like, I've been studying Korean for quite a while, but like, I never practice it. Even though I had like, really ample chances when I was in college, because there was a lot of Korean speaking students. I am friggin... Super Weenie Hut Juniors, my friends, and I was too nervous to talk to any of them. So I basically missed every chance to talk to somebody in my target language because I was too, too nervous to talk to any of them. I started learning when I noticed patterns in the alphabet because I listened to a lot of Korean music. And then, like, I, I was like, oh, this is surprisingly easy. And I just kind of kept with it because it was surprisingly easy. I recently started learning Japanese and, like, I can finally read it a little bit better than I could before. But still not as good as most other languages. Or at least not as good as my, my Korean knowledge is. What a shame to cover up those muscles. Then again, I could backtrack and do like a short sleeve kind of outfit. I don't know. Ooh, cool. Yeah, I don't have a whole lot of knowledge of the Ukrainian language either, so... <laughs> Let me switch up my reference board here. I didn't create a super solid plan for what I wanted to be drawing today. I'm just kind of rolling with it. Alright, let me go back to that other board. Honestly, that's super cool, though. Like, any reason for wanting to learn a language is a really good and valid reason. paused and not drawing much, but I'm looking for the right kind of inspiration here. I think the biggest challenge is just not really knowing any people that speak Korean. 
I wish that I had somebody that knew. Alright, yeah, I'm just gonna undo all of that because I changed my mind on what kind of thing I want to do. Okay, honestly though, even if your pronunciation is bad, you still know multiple languages and that's more than most Americans can say. such glorious big muscles so it's hard for me to say how his arm would rest. Honestly, though, I know the feeling. I once recorded myself while I was just like doing a whole bunch of nothing and randomly singing, and I was like, ooh! Listening back to the recording, I was like, oh, oh god, that was bad. That was also before I started any like vocal training. Like, I'm actually trying to genuinely learn now. Don't like what that is doing. being too hypercritical of my own stuff right now because I am not super into it today. It also doesn't help that I'm looking at like a billion different references and like can't make up my own freaking mind. I'm gonna just undo all of that again. I can't make up my mind. It's a problem. So I do like the high neck thing. I'm a sucker for that. But I also like asymmetrical stuff because I'm a weirdo. So I think what I'm going to do is instead this time. Let's see, how would I do that? sense if it came up across the other shoulder.
feel free to tell me any stories you want. I'm honestly mostly just existing right now because I, like I said, I don't have a whole ton of energy, so I'm like, I'm here, but that's about the best I can do for today. I can't get this arm right. Or at least I can't get it to a way that like I'm comfortable with. Also still doesn't feel right. Ah, this is frustrating. to a VTuber that played Valorant and because it was opposite day you forced her to play with inverted mouse. Oh gosh. I would fail so hard at absolutely everything. Like I'm already bad enough but like add in an inverted mouse in that and ah. Uh, nope, that'd be the end of it. the evilest thing you ever said? I'm a little afraid. Even worse with the highest sensitivity. Bro, that makes the mouse go all over the freaking screen. Still just does not look great at all. It's this one arm that I just cannot feel satisfied with myself about. Take a pause and work on his face a bit. I guess that's fair. Just being absolutely chaotic. It fits the theme for Chaos Day.
I mean, I'm gonna end up being myself regardless, but I feel like yeah, I might get a little bit too overwhelmed if everything's just constant chaos. Which, I guess at least I'm aware that I have issues with things like that. I like predictability, to be honest. If things are, like, too chaotic and I don't know what's going to happen, I get really anxious. Everything's been off lately. The energy in the whole house has been weird. Even my brother is extra anxious lately. I don't know. Today just seems like an odd day. <laughs> it's not so much that I'm not in the mood, it's just that I feel like I'm not happy with my work right now. Plus, I'm also, like, trying to set myself on a schedule and sticking to it, and that's really hard when, like, I can't speak for everybody that, that's got chronic issues like me, but for me, at the very least, like, my, my condition can change in, like, minute by minute or even hour by hour, so I can agree to plans in the morning and then by the afternoon be like, uh, I regret that. So sticking to a stream schedule is very difficult and I don't really have the kind of following where I can just randomly decide, hey, I'm going to stream literally right this second and expect anybody to show up. I feel like it's a, like a universal thing, honestly. Like, if you like what you do in any capacity, you're gonna have days where you just don't feel happy with what you're making. And it sucks that I'm feeling this particularly right now because this is a character that I really love to draw and I'm just not feeling it. I feel like I'm not doing him justice. And partially because I need more practice drawing muscular figures. I haven't been doing enough anatomy studies, and I feel like it shows. Ah, those monolid eyes. a really slow artist and I don't like that I'm a slow artist. Like even on a normal day I'm super slow at it. Although some of my other art friends think it's because I probably have ADHD and I'm not I'm not medicated for that. <laughs> I'm medicated for so many things but not for ADHD. Of course I haven't even gotten a doctor to even agree to evaluate me so yay fun! I 
hate that feeling, like when you finish something. So it's short. It's an acronym for Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder. But basically, the biggest hallmark is inattention. Like, you can't really focus on anything. And for me, it comes in the form of chronic overwhelm, where I've like got so many things that I want or need to get done that I can't even figure out where to start, and I can't really stop my racing thoughts. So I'm pretty much constantly thinking and can't really stop. And he's got demon eyes, because of course he does. <laughs> well, I remember you said you're autistic, and it's common for them to overlap. There's also a lot of overlapping symptoms between... Wow. I don't know what to say to that. But no, it's... it's... Well, it could be part... Just the fact that, like, I'm constant... Uh, that's one of my big... Now, I just... I want your time, my friend. I'll be here for a little while longer. Sorry for the random pauses. I'm also trying to check on things. I feel like I need to move the ears slightly up. Not quite aligning with where it needed to be. Ooh, warm milk is good. That's one of my favorite things to do at the end of the night is to just chill with a good book and a warm drink and then I can just relax a bit and unwind from the day. earring because he is not as flashy as I like to be. Ooh. Oh wow, what luck. Same, I also have chronic pains that keep me from sleeping. Like last night it felt like every single position I was laying in created a pressure point and I just could not relax enough. So I was like rolling over and over like a freaking rotisserie chicken. It's one of the reasons why I haven't been searching super hard for another job after boxing. Yo, I would die in my first match. <laughs> well, boxing, like, boxing is a lot of activity, though. So, like, your body doesn't hate you. Your body is just tired. No, I don't want to hear that. That's bad. That's scary. Satisfactory. My issue is that I just can't seem to find happiness with my work lately. Oh my god, a coma for a week. I mean, I bet you ended up in a freaking coma for a week after fighting a good friend. Like, that's... that's intense. Like, here I was thinking it was bad enough when I used to be a barista. Of course, that was mostly just because normal work is difficult for people like me with chronic pain. As delightful as that was. I also made an absolutely shit wage. That didn't help. 
Ooh. Bro, you were doing real bad. And like, man, with all those injuries too, like, that, that healing time would have taken a lot, lot more time even after coming out of the coma. And like, even just a week in a coma can cause a lot of problems too. Like, I had a friend whose medication put her in a coma for about a week. Actually, it was like a week to two weeks, so it wasn't like a super, super long time, but it was a long enough time. Because like that whole like long stretch of no consciousness, like that will cause a lot of trouble. A lot of trouble. Also, I'm still having to... Like, I'm still paranoid that my chat issue didn't get fixed, so I'm still looking back at my YouTube chat tab to make sure it's it's working properly. And that is slightly higher than what it needs to be. There. So now the problem is I made the eyebrow too slow. Yay, I'm doing great. That's where the edge of the base is. Cool. <laughs> I mean, I imagine it was a hell of a fight, but with that many injuries, yikes. At least the paycheck was worth it. Because, like, I, I've been laid up for a while. I had a really bad car wreck a few years ago. And, or actually it was more than a few years ago now. It was a handful of years ago. But it was still bad enough that, like, I ended up having to quit my job. So, like, I know how it feels to be stuck on the mend like that with a lot of energy. Or with a lot of injuries. And no energy. But, like, man... It's weird to me to think that the, like, it comes with the trade being injured on the job, but, like, you're literally getting paid for it. It's kind of cool, but also kind of terrifying. Alright, now the question is, can I make this look like my friend? Because now we have... Issue trying to draw in his hair. Oh, I actually didn't know that. I mean, it kind of makes sense that you can't get it till you're 18, because you kind of got to be an adult to do dangerous things, but also, like, I never really thought of it. You gotta be a bum to want to be a boxer? What does that mean? Is that like something to do with like the willingness to fight?
You know, my boss's husband says the same thing about joining the Marines. Oh, no, no. My boss's husband is in the Marines. My my boss is the owner of the company. So, like, technically I'm... I'm supposed to be part of, like, a trio of YouTubers, but I'm the alpha release because I was the only one who was willing to do it for basically nothing. <laughs> no, he is in the U.S. Marines. I don't know how, how bad the Italian Marines are. But military dudes tend to be a little bit dumb. The very least, the U.S. Marines sure as heck are. Bunch of crazy ass weirdos they all are. I mean, I feel like you have to be at least some level of smart to join the Marines. Some of the other branches, however, they, they take lower scores for the, the tests and things that they do for that. Oh, you're on YouTube, my friend. I am responding to my Twitch chat. <laughs> all caps is fine. There, There's no shame here for all caps. Oh wow, like you actually have to have some level of higher education for the Italian Marines? That's interesting. Like honestly, most of the US military gets suckered into enlisting because of not having a degree. Like they basically taunt, hey, you can go to college for free. And then they're like, surprise, now you're stuck in this crappy job you hate. I think we're all eager for him to be out of the military. <laughs> Alright. I'm gonna bring that strand down, because his hair is longer. Italian supremacy. <laughs> I mean, anytime somebody asks where I'm from and I say I'm from the US, I usually follow it up with unfortunately. Although, to be honest, I don't know where else I would go. Although, I guess not. Well. Yeah, I guess the only other language I actually have some bit of proficiency in is Korean, so probably South Korea. I don't know, I've never really been able to travel. There. Hair tied back. Loose ponytail. But that. I do need to edit a bit. What's there to do in the US? Honestly, that's a good question. Cause like, <laughs> there's a whole lot of nothing out here. As, it, as weird as it is. I'd like to visit Italy. But again, I can't really travel much. Traveling is expensive. It's on my bucket list. There's a lot of cool places with like really awesome architecture and <laughs> southern US you only have corn. That's the Midwest. That that's like middle US. That that's where all the corn is. Um Southern US is, is more known for things like cotton. And um let me think what else? Ah, I guess cotton in a handful of, like, stuff? I don't know. 
Like, I know there's a handful of fruits and things. All right, anyways. There's his face. Sung Hyun's face. All caps on purpose. That, I mean, it's... Friend, you can yell at me in chat if you want. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna get upset. I just don't like people yelling at me in person because it's loud. <laughs> and no, nah, I, I have, I have focus problems. Don't, don't be surprised if it takes me five thousand years to get a piece of art done because I, I, I can't focus. <laughs> my, my friend, it's late for you. Don't feel bad if you need to go and go to sleep. At the very least, tomorrow's stream, since I moved the yesterday's stream, it'll be later. Because I usually don't stream early if the kid is home. <laughs> we'll have fun with that, my friend. I feel like it has to be... Like, certain situations for me to tolerate people yelling. I don't do well around loud noise, which is ironic because my, the, my favorite VTuber to watch does a lot of yelling. I'm literally only just now realizing how ironic that was. Alright, anyways. So, like, at the very least, we would have... Man, I am really not satisfied with my work today. Ugh. Having a great time. I, I just feel like it's an off day. and That's just it. It's just an off day. So I'm not super satisfied, but like I want to be. Also, my phone timed out, so now I can't see my reference image for the outfit. Alright, so... Or could have his hand like resting on his hip instead. I can't, I can't decide. I can't make up my mind. Today has been such an off day. Drawing some fault loops. Buckle. I want to put in some like rivets and stuff to make it have some kind of texture. Trying to plan outfits is complicated. Actually, I might do something with that other outfit I saw up further. Yeah, something a bit more like that. Maybe. I was going to leave one arm bare, but I think I'm going to do both. Just gives more excuse to show off muscles. Why not? I need more practice drawing muscular figures anyways. So then let's do something like that. seriously cannot decide how I want this to end up looking by the end. Yeah. 
just don't know. Because I can't be the only one wearing some kind of chains, right? friend. Not a whole lot. I am struggling through not feeling super happy with my art today. Feels like it's just been an off week. <laughs> Which I'm trying to power through it and not like get stuck in toxic thought cycles, but there's only so much I can do against that. Well, it's almost the weekend. It's the final day of the work week, so hopefully the weekend will feel a bit more chill. I'm gonna double check my chat tabs again just to make sure that the past few streams, Streamlabs has not wanted to properly do my multi-stream chat. It's making things a little bit difficult when I'm trying to actually engage. I feel like this needs more, but I don't know what. Definitely good for resting. Like, I wanted to do more art this weekend off stream, but honestly, I don't know that I will. I may just end up reading the whole time and maybe playing some Animal Crossing. Alright, so pocket. I am currently drawing my demon counterpart. So I am the angel and Sung Hyun here is the demon. And I'm trying to come up with a really cool outfit aesthetic for him. And I just, it's, I'm finding it difficult today. Welcome back. I'm looking like 
I've got like a whole board here on Pinterest that I'm looking at for inspiration. But like, I'm just not... I don't have that like super intense feeling of like, yes, this is perfect. No, I just, I'm like, I'm doing something and I guess it's working. But I'm being a little hypercritical of myself in my head and I'm trying to tell myself to stop it. Yes, this character is. Uh, also trying to remember to stretch regularly when I'm drawing. I don't often stretch my shoulders enough. And they tend to get stuck. strong. Oh, hell yeah! <laughs> I've never personally been to either country, so I can't say whether one or the other is better, but I will say there's only one in which I know more of the language. I'm just gonna sit back, sit back and watch the this little exchange here. This is this is fun. That is entirely fair. I, I've talked about my boss's family before, and like their husband is born in Korea but adopted by a white family, so he's like the most non like non Korean Korean man I've ever met that's because he didn't grow up around Korean people I can't really speak ill of France a lot of, there's a lot of really cool art spaces there too There's a lot of places I want to go in both France and Italy that are very art-centric that I want to go see in person. Korean myself, so I can't really speak on it a whole ton, but like, there's a lot of really awesome creators in Korea too. There's also a handful of French ones that I like. No need to be super, super aggressive though. Okay. I'm gonna get in and start working on some of these details. At least what I can until time runs out. I 
I think the one thing we can all agree on is that all three of those countries are better than the U.S. <laughs> I fully agree with you there. I mean, I guess there's some cool places in the U.S., but on the whole, the U.S. kind of sucks. I'm unfortunately stuck here. Super favor this. The US is kind of way too focused on this whole idea of okay, yeah, the no healthcare thing especially. I don't I don't know why, but there there's just like a whole allergy about caring about other people here in the U.S. and it sucks. Never been there either, so I also can't really speak to that country, but I hate the U.S. I hate living here. I feel trapped, so probably would if given the chance. I haven't really had the chance to go anywhere, really. That, that genuinely is what it feels like. Like, it sucks for absolutely everybody, but it sucks even worse if you're not white. tablet because it's not touch screen. On this specific drawing, I started it like right when, or a few minutes after I started streaming, so I've been sketching on it for a little over an hour. 
But if you're asking in general, then I like I've been drawing for multiple decades. I'm a pretty slow artist compared to most. I'm aware of it. I also don't like it. <laughs> I like it. I like the way you put that. Eons of training. Because that legitimately feels like how it is. My parents' house still has crayon drawings on the walls from my childhood. Uh, but now this, this one I've spent... I started at this stream, so it hasn't been that long. Can't blame me for being slow when there's this hilarious exchange happening in chat, though. So it seems like I haven't had any issues with chat today. That's good. This last couple streams, it has not been wanting to work. So I guess it is resolved for now. Hopefully it won't become an issue again later, though. to rest your hands. So, like, skin irritation? Do you have anything that can soothe it? Like, aloe? Probably not a lot you can do about it then, huh?
Isn't that how you're supposed to do, like, workouts, though? You just go till it starts to hurt a little bit? Because, like, the whole point is pushing yourself past your previous point, right? And especially in the beginning, like, when you first start doing stuff like that, like, you can't really count it. Because it's not the numbers that count, it's just the activity itself. You know, my older brother used to do that all the time when he was still running cross-country. I always wondered why he would continue to torture himself like that. Like, my older brother used to run till he puked, like, all the time. say that, yet he was the troublemaker between the two of us. Like, between me and my twin brother and my older brother, my older brother was so awful, my mother says that I am lucky to even exist. I like that is just not... It was, I feel like it was more that he just, like, would rather run than do most other things. I think that was his way of, like, turning his brain off for a while. Didn't have to think, just had to run. Weirdly enough, that brother is now in the army. That, I just don't know how that fold should be. It is not where I want it to be. That is for sure. No, he is not in the Italian army. My my entire family lives in the US, so everybody I know is US army. And a handful of US Marines I know. If it makes you feel better, he's also my rival. <laughs> my my older brother and I have like butted heads our entire lives because like he used to do art and then I started doing art and I got better at it. He's also further ahead than me in terms of streaming as well. But you know what? I ain't giving up. Not giving up at all. Alright, let's see if I can get that to look halfway decent. Treading to put on the boots. <laughs> if I can ever actually get to a point where I can afford to travel.
Like, there's so many places that I would love to go to. <laughs> it absolutely does. I'm not going to argue with, with that. I can't argue with the truth. job was easy enough. Even finding employment is nearly impossible because everybody wants experience but nobody wants to give it. So you spend entire years applying to jobs only to get Rejection email after rejection email. I mean, I'd like to be good at singing. I don't know that necessarily that I am currently good at singing. But I'm going to step out for just a moment. I shall be back shortly. short break. Are you good there, Samwise? <laughs> Knocked over the foam board I have sitting in here for another project, and he... Please don't knock my cup over, Sam. Well, I don't know Italian, so I don't know how well I could sing Italian songs. I actually know a decent bit of Korean, so I probably could sing BTS better. Samwise. Well, the boy has demanded attentions. Little man, if you're gonna climb on my desk in stream, then I'm gonna cuddle you. You should have learned this by now. Well, that doesn't make me feel any better. I stutter a lot when I get nervous. Oh my goodness, Samwise. You're a very good cat, but you're also in the way, bud. I can't draw through you. Very good cat he is. I'm not gonna do the whole detailing for that, I'm just gonna... I 
I don't think I do want to know. Sam. <laughs> At the very least, I'm going to look up that song so that I can listen to it after stream. Mr. Sam. Sir. I cannot say no to you. You are so adorable, but I am in the middle of a stream here. Kitty cat. Oh. You are being too sweet, mister. If your ear itches, you can scratch it, you know. You don't have to keep holding it in a weird position. There you go, climb in the lap, not on the desk. I have plenty of lap space, my thighs are plenty thick. <laughs> I'm not gonna bark at my cats, I love these cats. Besides, they get barked enough at by the dog. I have a German Shepherd. And she is crazy high energy. Actually, let me come back to that. I don't know. <laughs> tough times create tough men. I mean, I'm sure, but I've had plenty of tough times and I'm tired of being tough. I want to be weak and soft for a bit. I do know what a Top Gun is. I mean, that's the first time I've heard it described that way, but okay. Although I can't really relate to being confused about your own sexuality, because honestly, not me. I know full well I am belligerently bisexual. Question is, can I even sketch these hands in a way that I'm satisfied with? I feel like I need to use a secondary color to sketch it out. Oh, I fully believe in toxic masculinity. There's plenty of men I don't want anything to do with because of shit like that. Use blue to contrast. The wrist is there. I can... So, I guess. I just don't like the way it looks. I mean, typically, if I'm not doing either of those, I'm usually just minding my own business, vibing. Or should I just do something different? I feel like I need to do something different. Question is, what the hell am I gonna do?
Hmm. Don't know how I want to do that one. To be honest, I am feeling kind of stuck. And I feel like I'm freezing too much trying to get through this drawing. I may just cut it short for today. Because, I mean, yeah, I haven't really been feeling it anyways. Considering I haven't been feeling it, that's still pretty good for an off day. But yeah, I guess cutting it a little bit short isn't going to hurt. So I'm going to go ahead and end today's stream. I will be back tomorrow with a Horizon Forbidden West game stream. Uh, and then I will have next week's schedule up probably Sunday. I'll see how that's going to go. I also have to double check because I think there's some appointments and things coming up next week that I got to be mindful of. So yeah, I'll, I'll have next week's schedule up probably Sunday. I'm going to go ahead and end today and just kind of mellow out for a little bit. Chill out with the cats some, I think. And uh, yeah. Thank you guys for joining me today. Even if it was an off day, it was still nice to, to see everybody. And yeah. I don't really know how to respond to the auto mod warnings there, my friend, but I did see that you just followed, so hopefully I'll see you in the next one. I'm gonna go rest a little bit more before I have to go get the child of the house from school. So, again, thank you for war or thank you for joining me. Thank you for spending time with me. It was great. Always remember to take care of yourselves, guys. Drink some water, eat some good food, get some good sleep. Don't listen to your brains if you got a mean one. And I will be back next time. Bye-bye.